here we will write a program to calculate total and percentage of a student using inheritance. Here we are going to define three class. First class will accept the roll number and name. The second class will accept mark of three subjects and third class will display the total and percentage along with roll number, name and mark of three subjects. So, first we will define class student. In this class we are going to accept the roll number and name. So, we will define two variables roll number and name. Here we will define these variables as public. So, we can access the value of these variables in our inherited class. Then we will define the constructor for class student with two parameters roll number and name. Then we will assign these constructor variables to our local variables. Then we will define second class mark which inherits class student. Inside this class we are going to accept mark of three subjects. So, we will define three variables mark 1, mark 2 and mark 3. Here also we will define these variables as public. Then we will define constructor for this class and here we will define constructor variables as roll number, name and mark of three subjects, string name and mark of three subjects as mark 1, mark 2 and mark 3. And here we will inherit the base class variables roll number and name. And here we will assign the constructor variables mark 1, mark 2, mark 3 to our local variables. Then we will define third class result which inherits mark. Inside this class we are going to calculate the total and percentage. So, we will define two variables total and percentage. Then we will write a constructor for this class with base class variables. So, in roll number name and here we will inherit the base class variables roll number name mark 1, mark 2 and mark 3. Then we will write a method to calculate the total and percentage and inside this method we will calculate the total as mark 1 plus mark 2 plus mark 3. And we will calculate the percentage as total divided by 3. And then we will display the result inside the method display. And here with console dot write line we will print the information. First we will print roll number. Then we will print name. Then we will print mark of first subject. Then mark of second subject. Then mark of third subject. Then total and percentage. Then to execute this in another class main method, first we will accept the values of roll number, name and mark of three subjects. For this we will define variables. Then we will accept the variable values. So, first we will accept roll number. In roll number variable we will accept it by converting to integer using console dot read line. 
then we will accept the name in name we will accept it since it is string no need to convert it then we will accept mark of first subject then second subject and third subject then we will create object of our class result and we will pass these variables as a constructor variable so first roll number then name then mark 1 mark 2 and mark 3 and then we will call the methods find result from that class and then we will call the method display from that class and then we will execute it it will ask to enter the roll number then name then mark of three subjects it will print roll number name mark of three subjects then total and its average or percentage so here first we have defined the class student with variables roll number and name then class mark which inherits the class student with three variables mark 1 mark 2 mark 3 then another class result which inherits the mark and here we calculate the total and percentage and we will display the information about roll number name and marks using the method display then in another class we have accepted the variables values and we have created the object of our class result and we have executed the method find result and display